First of all, very nice to meet you again, Bonnie. Thank you. When I spoke to you on the, on the set of the last movie, you were saying you were particularly excited about what was to come in these final two films. Yes. Did they live up to your expectations? Yeah, definitely. I think for, for all of us, it's always been obviously such a climax to these, to these last few moments that we've, we've had. And I think we've all particularly wanted to kind of give as much energy and as, as much as we can, really, mm. in this last kind of, you know, it's the last one for the audience. So they definitely did live up to my expectations yeah. and more, really. How does it feel having, and I've been on every set since 01, having gone through all these movies and all mm -hmm. these years, is it... Uh, is it strange, just almost like stepping out of the character all the time, or has it been a blur? Has it seemed like a long time? How's it felt for you? Yeah, it's bizarre when you kind of. I think only until, you know, when you're in the kind of, you're in the, you know, you're you're filming and you're in the mix of it all. It's sometimes quite hard to sort of see it as a bigger picture. You can be quite absorbed into, you know, just the set and that day. And then I think with with finishing and coming to an end, you now have that moment when you reflect upon everything, mm. and it's. It's become such a bigger journey than it kind of was for me, I think, at the beginning, whilst I was in it, because it just... And to think that first day in comparison to the last day, is, it's kind of like two different worlds, really. Have you enjoyed the arc of Ginny's character as it's gone through the books and through the movies? Yeah, I think for me it's always been... I quite, you know, I think for me what was really enjoyable is the fact that it did grow and there was something, there was new things to put in, into her and her character really developed and, and, and really, I don't know, stood up to the challenge, really. And I think that's really... For me, for an actress, it's the mm. perfect. It's the perfect role to have to, to develop. In in part one, we get uh, Dumbledore's army is reunited. Mm -hmm. uh, was that was that exciting to be part of it? Was there a good sort of kinship between yourself and Matthew and Ivana? Was it a good yeah. bond there? Yeah, I think I was. Um, you know, I think with with the three of them, they're much more the silent sort of heroes. Yeah. You know, they sort of they're sort of continuing that Dumbledore's army feeling back at Hogwarts, which is you know the ch a changing face of Hogwarts completely. So I think when when they return in the second part, Harry, Ron, and Hermione. Mm and they see that they're still battling for them. I think they're truly touched that, you know, they're still fighting, you know, even though it seems so impossible, the yeah. end. And I enjoyed that, kind of, the little silent warrior kind yeah. of character. <laughs> Have you had a chance yet even to think back over the, over the period and pick out other moments that will always stay with you? Yeah, definitely. I think, I mean, it's... I think it's sometimes hard to pinpoint those few little mm. moments and few days. It's kind of quite a collective feeling I have when I, when I reflect upon things. I think though mainly I think you know when you think about the things you'll miss and I am missing is is those moments when you know just those simple moments when we're all together and we're all on set and surrounded by people that we've grown such close friendships with and and sort of bonds with and it just there's such a safety there that we have and such a warmth and and that's something that I'm really missing already. Has it been quite surreal seeing yourself almost growing up on screen? Yeah it's weird I think you know when you kind of grow I guess for us we grow you know everyone grows up mm. in their own skin so for me it's I see myself kind of every day, so it's kind of quite hard to see myself grow up. But I'm sure kind of ten years' time, if I walked them all back, I, could be, I can see it more physically. Has it been easy to find the friends who you've had who are real friends are, and compared to those who want to hang around with you because you're an actress in this wonderful franchise? Yeah, I guess, you know, I guess what those kind of things can come with, mm. with the job. But I think, you know, like anyone, you still, you have those loyal friends, from, you know, and, and for me, being able to always continue with my schooling, I still mm. had all my, my school friends and my family and, and just everyone that was there to support me. And, and I think that really helps you to sort of, I don't know, focus and, and to be there and to know that you have people around you. In terms of life after Hogwarts. Mm -hmm. Will it be, is it movies or is it fashion or have you, have you decided which road to, to take? Yeah, it's definitely, I mean, be it either movies or television or theatre, acting yeah. is kind of my pathway. So, yeah. you know, I guess, I guess it's just to, you know, find that next job and that next challenge um, for me now. And just as a final question, did you manage to get any any souvenirs to take away? Yeah, I don't know, everyone keeps saying Either that. Either inadvertently or <laughs> um, blatantly. Yeah, I mean, it's weird enough, they seem to be very protective of yeah, all the sets so and all, everything. <laughs> it's quite hard to um, get anything. But, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if they'll give something as along the way. But I guess, I guess you know, what's amazing about it is you can watch over the films. And yeah. there, but if really. you could take one thing, um, if you offered you a chance to take something that was representative of your character. Yeah, I think for me, I guess, you know, one thing that, you know, part of my costume or something that I spend a long time mm. in, be it sort of the Gryffindor cardigan or just something quite simple <laughs> but means quite a lot to me. Okay. Well, nice to meet you again. Thank Best you. of luck. Thanks. Cheers, buddy.